In the remote areas of Gavango in Namibia, we find Tinika Angela Mushova. Her small village is more than 20 miles from a main road and 100 miles from the nearest town, Rundu. My life has been very difficult, and even survival. We all live in this one-room house. Every morning, we wake up early. I make a fire to warm up water for the ones that attend school. I make porridge for breakfast, so they have energy throughout the day, and then walk them halfway to school. It's five miles walk to school. We are very dependent on agriculture activities in our village. Since I was young, I never had opportunities to be employed. In the bush around many villages in the region, grows a wild plant with amazing pharmaceutical properties. It's known as the devil's claw. This is due to many hooks and barbs on the seed pods. NNF working with the U.S. aid program, Sarap, has been conducting workshops in the villages in Caprivi. The emphasis of the workshops is twofold. One, to ensure all harvesting of the plant tubers is sustainable. And two, the dried tuber is of a high enough quality for the pharmaceutical industry. The resulting product is used to treat joint-related problems, including arthritis, and has its biggest market in Germany. Village groups are also formed to obtain harvesting licenses from the Namibian government. Right. Before you put it in the bag, yeah? for you to check that, okay, fine. This is kakaja. Right. Yeah? Take a slice. Take a slice like this, yeah? And then you try to I hope for Devil's Claw Price to rise up and more training in harvesting the plant so we make better quality production. Weather conditions are not controllable and climate change is affecting us here. Through the sustainable harvesting of the devil's claw tubers, the social economic benefits are far-reaching. Water and school fees paid, solar panels and communication becomes available. This cash income crop can also help obtain livestock that in turn provides much needed protein for a healthy rural population. Devil's Claw has always been here, but we had no use for it. Now, it has a value. We look after it. The money it brings is important to us. <laughs>